MSNBC host Joy Reid says it's time for Democrats to officially give up on white people and start viewing them as the enemy. In a recent podcast, Reid says that instead of trying to win back millions of white voters who backed Barack Obama and then voted for Trump, Democrats should simply give up on them and focus only on the votes of minority groups. Listen. Democrats have all of these things that they want to do all at the same time. They pine for the Trump voter who they think they can somehow talk into not being for Donald Trump. And they feel, you know, what did we do to you? How did we hurt you? If we can find some way to appease <laughs> you, will you come back to us, please? I do know that if you needed 77,500 people, it's a lot easier to get 50,000 black people in Philadelphia, Detroit, uh, and Milwaukee than it is to figure out what is in the minds of those Obama to Trump votes. There's a lot here, but notice first how Reid's entire speech is framed in terms of political expediency. Struggling white people voted for Obama in big numbers because they were hurting and hoping someone would help them. That didn't work out. Instead, the Obama administration often seemed indifferent to their decline, sometimes even happy about it. So, still hurting, they turned to Trump. Reid's view is, in effect, oh well, the jig is up, we don't need their support anyway. It's not worth looking at why they're miserable or why they're abandoning our party. Reid's statement is also zero-sum. Her view is that in America, you can't help minority voters and white voters at the same time. Their interests are opposed to one another. America isn't one nation, it's simply different racial groups struggling for supremacy. A lot of people on the left believe that. Let's hope for the sake of this country, the Democratic Party ignores that advice. That's it for us.